Hi and welcome to my review of the Karcher WV2 Premium Window Vac. The window vac is intended to be used indoors and outdoors for cleaning windows, for cleaning flat surfaces, so that includes floors, TVs, I've pretty much used it on everything. Um, with the Premium model you get the added bonus of the cleaning solution, you also get the cleaning solution spray bottle and you also get a smaller squeegee board. Now looking inside the box, as you can see, I've, I've already used this product. You get a large squeegee. You get the, of the main body dismantled. You get the spray bottle. You get the little microfiber cleaning cloth. And that's another part that goes with it. And you've got this nice energy board. And you've also got the construction manuals and cleaning solution. And you've also got the guarantee there as well. This is the guarantee. So a product registration, which also registers the product for a further two years for um, the manufacturing warranty for the product. Fortunately, this product came already charged for me, well, partly charged when I first used it. So that's always very good. I'm just going to put the pieces together now. So this is this bit here is the bit that collects the water, and this bit does actually just pop out. So I'll just try and pop that out for you. So it pops out like this, and then you've got that as the main body. So if we put that all back in, again, it's very easy to put together again. And then we slot this other bit onto here. And then we just put this little cleaning blade there. Now that is the product setup. So if you have a look at it, it's very, very lightweight. That's the first thing I realized when I used it. It's a very lightweight product. It's very um, easy to use as well. Um, I'm not actually, going to show you the um, cleaning solutions that's very simple and easy so right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how it works in the bathroom I'm going to do this I'm going to do a little sample of it on the shower screen so I think that's the best place where you'll be able to see the results I am now in the bathroom and I'm now going to show you how loud the window back is do bear in mind that this window back is in the bathroom and it will echo a lot and sound a lot louder than it actually is Okay, so that is a window back. It sounds really loud, but it's not actually that loud. We are in the bathroom once again. I have wet my shower screen and put a little bit of cleaning um, solution on as well. You can give it a quick wipe, but my shower screen is really clean and I just wanted to show you the effect of the window back. I believe this is a good example to show you because it gives you a nice insight into cleaning a window, cleaning your mirrors and getting a nice street free finish. So as you can see, my shower screen has been cleaned fully and it has left a very nice streak-free finish and it looks pretty brand new to me actually, like it's just been newly fitted. This is really quite impressive seeing as I really did struggle previously to, um, to clean my shower screen and there are so many people using it and all I wanted to do was go in there and quickly just give it a quick wipe or just have it um, water free straight away. So this window back is very very good at doing that, at taking away all the moisture and, and getting the bathroom very very clean. I actually also use it on um, the bath edges as I'll show you right now. As you can see, 
I did no wiping whatsoever. This was all the window back. So I literally, after using the bathroom or anybody using the bathroom, I go in as a window back and I quickly just put this on and suck up all of the um, leftover water and it, it does do a fantastic job. The bathroom's always looking sparkling, which is always very good. I wanted to show you once more the sound of the Karcher window back, but in a normal room. As you can see the window back is not very loud. You may have noticed that the green light was flashing on my window back next to where you switch on the device which is here. The reason why that was flashing was it was telling me that the battery is running low and I need to charge the unit. Um, so after cleaning the bathroom this is how much water the unit has picked up. There is a maximum line there that you can see so when it hits that maximum mark you should empty it. There's two places where you can empty it. The first one is here. So you just pull out this little bit here and you can just pour it out and then carry on with your cleaning. The other um, place you can do it is you just take the whole unit apart like I showed you at the beginning of this video and you just empty the solution out. And then you can um, clean the whole unit out, which is what I like to do. I like to keep my cleaning items very clean so I do tend to wash out this little tank after every single use so it stays nice and clean. Um, overall, I am very, very pleased with the Karcher window back. I do believe that it is a very good purchase. A few niggles with the product. At first, when I um, got the product and I opened it up, I was very excited. I decided to do my TV screen just to see the street free finish because the TV screen is one area where I always struggle to get a nice finish, especially with the, with the um, LCD um, displays that you have nowadays. And um, what happened was um, I used a capture window back, I just sprayed it down and gave it a quick wipe and there's little droplets of water still on the screen. And I used a capture window back over it and it was making this horrendous squeaking noise and it left these horrible streaks across the whole screen. I was like, well, I'm better off using a microfiber cloth. However, I persevered and the next day I put more solution on the TV and I used the capture window back and I realised what the error of my ways had been. It had been that I hadn't used enough solution. So my advice is use a lot of solution and allow the Karcher squeegee head to glide over the surface nicely and that way you won't get any streaks. So overall my impressions of this product are that it is fantastic. If you're able to get one, I say definitely get one because not only can you do windows, you can do pretty much anything in the house. I do everything. I actually do use the Karcher window back on numerous um, surfaces including my microwave, um, the floor even with my little children dropping liquid all over the floor so like no drinks or anything that fall on the floor instead of me getting out a little dishcloth I'm able to go and get the window back and just quickly um, clean that mess up. It is a very good product it is very lightweight, it's not that noisy, and it, the charge seems to last a very long time. So overall, I am very, very pleased with this product. I would give it 9 out of 10. I do believe there are a few little issues that could be um, improved. Maybe even um, the angle of the squeegee board allowing that to kind of flex a bit so you can get into those little awkward areas of a window. So and even like if you get to the bottom of a window so you can just um, tilt it upwards so you can get that last bit at the bottom. So that is my review for the Karcher window back. I would give the device a solid 9 out of 10. Thank you for watching.